By far and away the biggest thing to hit office ergonomics in a long time is a sit-stand workstation and it's here to stay and for good reason. So how often do you sit? How often do you stand? How do you set these things? We're going to figure that out. Hi, my name is Mike Gagino and I'm an ergonomics consultant with the State Compensation Insurance Fund. And in this video we're going to talk about sit-stand workstations. When you think about the human body, it was really designed for movement. So when we take the human body into an office setting and we ask it to stand still or sit still for eight hours at 90 degree angles, only moving our digits, our body is gonna tell us, hey, something's wrong here. We're gonna be experiencing fatigue and joint aches. And so we know that we need to move. Oftentimes I'm asked, you know, what's the best position to be in when I'm doing my office work, computer work? And the answer to that question is, your best position is your next position, which indicates you need to move. So we know we need to stand. Well, how often do we stand and for how long? Well, studies are coming in to show that over a 40 hour work week, the average is coming out to about eight to 15 minutes per hour is where it seems to be the most beneficial. When you need to set the height of your equipment, your keyboard, mouse, monitor, is gonna be the exact same principles as if you're in a seated position. And here's what I mean. For the purposes of the height of your keyboard, you wanna set it right at elbow level. If we're standing, we're sitting, same exact thing. For the mouse, elbow level. For the monitor, you want it set such that the top of the viewing screen is right at eye level with the understanding of most of what appears on that screen is about five to 15 degrees downward. That sets your head in a neutral position. The elbow level typing and mousing surface sets your shoulder and arms in a neutral position. So whether you're standing or you're sitting, you can be more comfortable throughout the day. 